Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about how to enable some new features inside the latest build for the better channel. As I've said yesterday, today I'm making a video which I'll show you how to enable all the remaining hidden and new features that are slowly rolling out in the latest build for the better channel. And in this video, we're talking about the build 22635.3420 or above, of course. And if you have at least this build, you're going to be able to enable these new hidden features or new features from Windows 11 because some of them were officially announced by Microsoft but are slowly rolling out. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to enable the new Copilot suggestion menu, the new ability to generate QR codes for sharing URLs, and also the new taskbar layout with the new widget section being on the right side, as you can see on my taskbar. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to enable all these. And if you enjoy videos like these, in which I'll show you how to enable different hidden features in Windows 11, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. This video is sponsored by Private Internet access. A virtual private network or VPN for shorts hides your IP address and safeguards your internet connection through an encrypted tunnel. Streaming services such as Netflix have different library options based on where you are located. Using private internet access, you will be able to watch those shows or movies that are not available in your current location. Make sure to check out private internet access in the links from the description below for a great deal. 83% discount and 4 months free. So as always, we're going to have to set up Vivetool and you can get Vivetool from the article below. Make sure to get the latest version.zip, then you can open it up using File Explorer, click on Extract All, click on Browse, and extract it into a dedicated folder, maybe in Local Disk C. As you can see, I created a folder, Hidden Features, inside the root of Local Disk C. I'm just going to select the folder. You can also copy the location because we're going to need it whenever we are running the commands, and then click on Extract. I'm going to have to replace the files because, of course, I already did this in previous videos, and this is how easily you set a Vive tool on your computer. Now, after we set a Vive tool, we have to open up the search box, type in here, CMD and then click on run as administrator. On user account control, of course, click on yes. Here inside CMD, we're going to have to copy and paste in a few commands. So these commands and IDs were discovered by Phantom Ocean 3 on Twitter. A huge shout out to him. You're going to have his Twitter link in the article below and also in the pinned comment below. So you can follow him because he does a great job by finding hidden features, IDs for features that are slowly rolling out and more. Now for the new Copilot suggestions, we have to run the first command and then the second command. And after you run each command, you should receive the message to successfully set feature configuration for the ability to generate QR codes for URLs whenever you're sharing them. You have to run this command and then again we have an additional two commands for the new taskbar layout with the widgets icon or button being on the right side of the taskbar near the system tray. And these are the commands that I need to run. All the commands will be in the article below so you can just copy and paste them from there labeled with which command does what. So I think that will be easier for you. And also to have the new taskbar layout related to widgets, you're also going to have to open up the Microsoft Store then go to library and then click on get updates. You have to be updated to the latest version of the Windows Web Experience Pack so that you can see the new taskbar layout inside this version of Windows. After you update all the apps, you're good to go. You can exit out from the Microsoft Store and restart your computer for the changes to take effect. So after the restart, we can now notice the new hidden features or new features inside this better channel build. First of all, let's open up Notepad and we can copy a text. I think you've already seen it in this video, but if we copy a text, we're going to notice this new menu that appears with Copilot and if we hover over it, it will expand and we have here a few options, send to Copilot in Windows Preview, Summarize, Explain and also Settings. Of course, this is a hidden feature, it's not officially announced by Microsoft, but it is hidden in Windows. I think this new menu is pretty interesting and useful, but it appears every time you copy a text, so that could be annoying sometimes. But if you go to Settings, basically inside Settings, Personalization and then Copilot in Windows, you have the ability with this new option to disable this new suggestion menu. So you have Show Copilot Suggestions menu on Copilot. When you copy text or an image, Copilot Suggestions menu appears automatically. You can turn this off if you don't want it, and basically those suggestions will no longer appear. This is basically another variant of something we've tested before, but I think this is pretty interesting because it's less intrusive. Basically, it only appears as a small bar. What I would like for Microsoft is maybe we don't want to do anything related to Copilot with the text that we've just copied, and when you click on an empty space, this menu should be dismissed. It is dismissed, but after a while, so it could be annoying sometimes. But of course, as this is a hidden feature, Microsoft is still working on it and they will improve it even further. Now let's go into the Microsoft Store and I'm going to show you the new ability to generate QR codes for copied URLs. So we can go and search for an app, for example, in the Microsoft Store. I'm going to go and search for Microsoft Photos. And we have here the ability to share the link. We can copy the link and more options. And you're going to see here we have the link. We can 
share it and we also have this button generate QR code if we click on it a QR code will be generated with that link and we can quickly share it to our phone I think that is pretty useful and lastly as I've said we have the new taskbar layout with the widget section and widgets button being on the right side near the system tray if you hover over it it will open from the right side of the desktop pretty similar to news and interest that was available in Windows 10 but of course this is only a thing when you have the taskbar layout set to left if you go to taskbar settings then scroll down to taskbar behaviors and set it to center the widgets button will go back into its original left location but if you set the taskbar to left it will be moved to the right side of the taskbar of course if you don't want it there you can always disable it from taskbar settings by disabling widgets or if you want it here but you don't want it to be opened on hover you can open the widgets board then go to settings and you have here an option open widgets board on hover disable this and whenever you're hovering over this the widgets section or board won't be opened on hover so these are the new features or hidden features that we can enable in the latest beta channel build the new copilot suggestions the new ability to generate qr codes for sharing links and also the new taskbar layout with the widgets button or icon being on the right side of the taskbar near the system tray if you want to enable or test these features on the latest build from the beta channel make sure to set a vibe tool on your computer get the commands from the article below in the video description and play around with the new features also please let me know below in the comments what you think about these new features if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future authors like this one i was Emmanuel from tech base until next time have a nice day